This is my uh, Sun SUX uh, HD. That stands for high, heavy duty, not high definition. It's a recumbent trike, uh, Delta style. That means the two wheels are in the back instead of in the front. And you'll see that I have it outfitted for touring. I put a little milk crate, I know very fancy on the back there, and an engine, a gas, a Honda 49cc gas engine uh, on there. That was quite a little endeavor. You have to retool the complete rear axle to do that. And then, of course, the uh, trailer for carrying stuff around. There's a top that goes with that and a few other goodies. The bike has been in storage for, oh, a year and a half. This is the first time I've even pulled it out. I'll start up the engine here in a few moments, give that a shot. Uh, the idea was a bike, we got somebody going by making noise there, sorry about that. The idea was a bike I could use both anywhere around town, so I could do the shopping, uh, grocery shopping, didn't matter what hills were in the way because I had the motor on it, and also a long touring bike so that uh, so let's say I wanted to uh, take a multi-state trip and uh, even if I didn't want to sleep out, if I wanted to use hit hotels along the way, maybe the next one was uh, 20 miles along the road while well, I had the engine there uh, to uh, help me make the last bit if I'd already gone as far as my legs would carry me in a day. So this is a bike with many options. Uh, it works well. If you're not familiar with the recumbent, you can see that uh, the steering bar, the handlebars, is actually this right here. This is how you steer it. I'll show you in a minute. And you sit in the seat and you're just, you're reclined back. Now that seat is actually quite adjustable. This bike, by the way, the HG I mentioned was heavy duty. This is the strongest, heaviest duty recumbent trike made. Uh, it itself, apart from the engine and trailer and anything you drag along, is 60 pounds, which is pretty heavy for such a bike. And, uh, but it can take up to a 400 pound person or 400 pounds of load. So that is, again, uh, uh, with uh, touring and uh, long distances in mind as desired. I also put this... Uh, extra handlebar on the front. It doesn't actually come this way. I thought I could mount some mirrors here on the sides, have a little more mirror. To be very honest, the system does not work well, uh, but the handlebars are good to have to put lights on the front or whatever. But the mirrors up front there vibrate too much to be able to really see. So what I use is the side mirror on the uh, ha actual handlebar, which again, I'll show you how that works here in a moment. Uh, the throttle for the motor and uh, is over here on the right handle grip. This is the throttle lever here. And you have normal hand brakes, which work fine. They are disc brakes, as you can see here. And I'll put in the ad, I'll put various specifications. To put the uh, towing uh, hitch on here, we just put a regular re uh, square bar here uh, and welded that on to the mounting where for of the motor so it's not very fancy